Greetings world, we are anonymous. The roller coaster rise and fall in gasoline and diesel prices over the last few years tracks changes in the cost of crude oil. Those changes are determined in the global crude oil markets by the worldwide demand for and supply of crude oil. Weak economic conditions in the U.S. and around the world in 2008 and into 2009 led to less demand, which helped push prices down. With the worldwide economic recovery underway, demand is on the rise again but unrest in the Mideast and North Africa has put supplies at risk. This combination of rising demand and reduced supply helped to push prices higher. Crude oil prices are set globally through the daily interactions of thousands of buyers and sellers in both physical and futures markets, and reflect participants' knowledge and expectations of demand and supply. In addition to economic growth and geopolitical risks, other factors, including weather events, inventories, exchange rates, investments, spare capacity, OPEC production decisions and non-OPEC supply growth all figure into the price of crude oil. The world's demand for oil increased sharply for several years, peaking at 86 million barrels per day in 2007. However, the global economic slowdown in recent years reversed this trend and demand fell for two consecutive years to just 85 million barrels per day in 2009, or 1 million barrels per day less than at its peak before rebounding in 2010. The Energy Information Administration expects growth to accelerate over the next two years reaching 88.8 .8 million barrels per day in 2012 and nearly 89 0.7 million barrels per day in 2013. DEA projects consumption in the Organization for Economic Cooperation and Development OECD, countries to be nearly flat in 2012 and 2013. Growth is concentrated in the non oak countries, including China, Brazil, and the Middle East with world gains of about 0.8 million barrels per day expected in 2012 and another 0.9 million barrels per day in 2013. The biggest single component of retail gasoline prices is the cost of the raw material used to produce the gasoline and dash crude oil. That price has been between $80 and $120 a barrel, depending on the type of crude oil purchased. With crude oil at these prices, a standard 42-gallon barrel translates to $1.90 to $2.85 a gallon at the pump. Excise taxes add another 49 cents a gallon on average nationwide. So the price for gasoline is already at $2.40 or more per gallon even before adding the cost of refining, transporting, and selling the gasoline at retail outlets. We, the people will not put up with the continuous price rise on fuel. Therefore Anonymous has decided to target 25 of the largest oil companies, in a bid to make them accept the millions of dollars profits they already make and to freeze any further price rises. Distributed denial of service attacks, defacements and leaks towards the listed or targeted companies' websites will all be classified as part of Anonymous Operation Fuel Strike. We are Anonymous. We are Legion. We do not forgive, we do not forget. Expect us.